So we're up on the rooftop of the ARV facility and you're looking at over 500 solar panels that are currently producing 63% of our annual energy. My name is Matthew Cunningham and I am a craftsperson and also the sustainability coordinator here at Advanced RV. I'm currently in school part-time for corporate environmental sustainability management and I'm passionate about all things renewable energy and conservation. We started this project almost a year ago from today. Mike Neundorfer came to me and asked to start exploring what kind of renewable energy options we could have here on site in Ohio. And so we actually looked at installing a wind turbine on site and we checked out a few different solar companies in the area. If you drove past our facility, you would have no idea that this is up here. We were looking at, first off, how much energy we consume here on the property throughout our daily operations and how do we reduce our energy use over time and that was going to determine the size of this solar array. We're also looking at the amount of sunlight that we receive in this part of Ohio. As you can see today is a little bit cloudy but for the past month we've had nothing but sunshine here in Northeast Ohio and this site has already produced over a hundred and 20 megawatt hours of power since its inception. We are also reducing our energy usage inside with the use of uh, LED lights and other smart energy efficient fixtures. So we're trying to reduce the actual energy that we need and in doing that we're actually putting energy back onto the grid here in Northeast Ohio. Here at the facility, we consume 1.1 megawatt hours on average per day in 2021. And we produce a little bit over 1.1 megawatt hours per day, at least this week, with our solar array. We use a system called Solar Edge, which actually looks on a panel level how much everything is producing. And we can diagnose any issues with the inverters or the panels if something gets shaded uh, we can see that on screen in real time. And now we have uh, optimizers that skip over anything that's damaged or blocked and allow us to continue producing uh, maximum power. We are consuming about 400 megawatt hours a year and this system will produce 250 megawatt hours per year when it's fully operational. This is our June production data and as you can see here, our one megawatt hour th threshold is this line right here. And we were surpassing it most days during the month. So we can look on a monthly level and a yearly level to understand how our production is aligning with the projected outcome of the array. This is a weight anchored system here. We have these non-invasive sleds nothing is being penetrated through the actual roof and each one is held down by a concrete block and a wind barrier on the northern side here so these panels are rated up to i believe 110 mile per hour winds we definitely did a lot of research when looking into which panels to purchase and these ones here are rated for 25 years of life and after their lifespan, there are technologies emerging in Ohio where you can actually send these off to get recycled and recover over 90% of the materials used in the panels. We're on the cutting edge of environmentalism and trying to understand our impact on the environment, how to reduce it, and how to create a cleaner planet for everybody.